Alright, uh, we'll mostly be working with the Nintendo DSi XL motherboard now. What we'll be doing, we'll be desoldering the old damaged and broken game slot and replacing it with a new one. Make sure you have the DSi or DSi XL game card slot. Just to give you a brief overview, what points we'll be desoldering. Uh, these are the points. Uh, we'll be desoldering these two points here. And once that those two are desoldered, we are easily... Uh, you'll see that this uh, will be separated uh, from the motherboard. Next, um, uh, we'll be desoldering the three uh, points here. There's one big one, and then there are two small legs. Uh, sometimes it gets a bit difficult to desolder these two, so you have the option of cutting uh, these two points as well. Next, um, we'll be desoldering this point here uh, then either you can use your desoldering braid and remove a bit of solder from here and remove this or you can simply yeah, remove it as well um, that's that's about it all right let's get going Alright, uh, grab your hot soldering iron, solder flux, and the desoldering braid. Uh, let's apply the flux to these two points first. And add a bit of solder there. Next, grab your desoldering braid and desolder it. Take off. Take off as much as you can. Next, remove from here as well. That's done. Next, uh, we'll be applying flux to these three points and adding a bit of solder and then using our braid and desolder this as well. Okay, grab your desoldering braid. And desolder this. You have to be a bit careful in this area, you don't want to damage any of the surrounding components. So 
So try to take off as much as you can in case it's not coming off or uh, there is another option that you can simply uh, cut these joints as well. That's more than enough. Next, the two small legs. Okay, next, um, this point here, so apply a bit of flux. Add a bit of solar. sorting blade. Okay, so just be ultra gentle and ultra careful with the surrounding components. That's off. Next, uh, all these small legs here. So apply a bit of flux. So uh, okay, grab your diesel ring raid. Not so high it even if you damage any legs, you're gonna remove it anyway. Okay. Next, uh, let's test it out and see if it's separating uh, from the motherboard. Alright, next, uh, grab a small micro turn precision screwdriver. And, okay, as you can see, so this leg is lifted off. And we will just lift off this leg as well, so grab your hot soldering iron, apply it to this side as well. Okay, so that's off as well. And 
just to blow it. Here. Okay, so we have these two legs that are off. This is just to show you, but uh, be ultra careful uh, not to apply too much force. Uh, you can damage any uh, all the solder pads uh, if you apply too much force here so you have to be a bit careful this is only just to show you so this leg is off as you can see and those two legs have come off next um, you can simply cut these legs as well so simply grab your uh, fine micro turn precision uh, sorry uh, tweezers and just cut this so that's fine cut here another fine cut there next cut this leg from here as well And now we are simply able to remove the game slot. So our game slot is separated from the motherboard. Let's clean up all these connections. Okay, let's clean up these connections, apply a bit of flux. All we are doing is just polishing the cylinder joints so that when we uh, place our new game slot it fits in nice and easy. Okay, that's done. All right, next, uh, grab your new uh, DS DSi Excel game slot and grab some isopropylene alcohol. What we'll be doing, we'll be cleaning up all these uh, connections here first, and then we'll apply a bit of flux. 
so that it um, so that eats the process of soldering. So clean up all the legs here. Wait a few minutes and then we'll apply flux. Alright, uh, let's apply flux. Okay, and let's place it onto our motherboard. Next, uh, we'll be placing our new game slot onto the motherboard. Before doing that, apply just a bit of flux. Okay, all you have to do is align these two pins with these two holes and place it on the motherboard. Make sure it's fit in there. Once it's fitted in, let's just Solder these two can points first. Grab your hot soldering iron and solder flux. It's done. Next, uh, these three connections here. Just trying to make a decent solder joint here, so next these two small legs. Done. Next, this joint here. And 
Okay. That's done. Next, all these small pins here. Uh, even if you uh, try to do as uh, as precise as you can, but even if you bridge them, you can always desolder it. So. Okay, let's just do a quick test to see if your pins are moving. That's fine, this is fine, it's fine, that's fine. Okay, there's a bit of joint there, so simply. That's it, all done. So we have um, soldered a new DSi game slot onto Nintendo DSi Excel motherboard. Next, even though we use no clean, no residue uh, flux, it's still a good habit uh, to clean up all this joints where we added the flux so grab your isopropyl alcohol grab some q-tips and cotton balls and do a bit of cleaning Grab some Q tips, dip it in isopropyl alcohol, and just do a final touch up cleaning. That's about it.